Becky, thanks for coming out to the clinic and I hope you got a lot out of it. We're gonna start off looking at your underwater video here. Uh, one thing I want you to notice is you're doing a little catch up there, that's good. But uh, when you're putting your hands in, uh, two things. The left arm is going in a very sharp angle downward. You can see the angle of the arm is, is down and the shoulder is very low right there. And then the right arm, you're actually what they call overreaching, which instead of the hand going in straight out from the shoulder, the hand is coming in out in front of your nose. And that's overreaching a little bit. That's not a very streamlined position. So that's one thing you can see that. And look at the, uh, look how the, the right arm goes in and, and kind of scoops. It's over in front. And you can see real clearly the left arm is going in a very steep angle and going all the way down. Oh, it's about real deep right there so you want to be real consistent it's also you have a little bit different entry based on if you're breathing it or not so you really want to make that uh, more consistent maybe some heads up freestyle will help you with that entry point you can watch keep your head up nice and straight and you can watch where the hands are entering the water watch that uh watch that right arm too when you're breathing you're starting to pull right there too early so you don't really have a lot of power when you start your pull on the side so that's one thing now the next thing is is the your hip rotation is good and uh glide looks okay but your your pull you don't really have a catch on the pull you're just kind of going right in the pull and you have really low elbows when you're pulling through see where the elbows are the arms are basically straight and the elbows are underneath your shoulders so you've got to get those elbows flared out outside of those shoulders when you're pulling all right you got to get those hands bent so work on your catch try to make sure you get that elbow up and over the hand and then start pulling back all right that's real real key to do that your above water here looks pretty good what I'm looking for is a, a high elbow on the recovery and not finishing too much behind yourself behind your head behind your your hips but something out to the side you look real good there uh, nice and smooth you look comfortable swimming which is the key somehow you just you see how that left arm is just diving straight down into the water and the right arm is overreaching just a little bit uh, you can see more of it underwater actually because you're you're coming in at you know at an angle and sort of coming in and scooping out in front so work on the heads up freestyle I think that'll really help one arm and work on that catch of the high elbow. Best of luck to you.